Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and this is our daily angelic message for March 28th, 2024. So let's see what we have today. Number 39, protecting treasure. This very, we're coming up, if if you celebrate Easter, like we're coming up on, you know, Good Friday, Easter, all that stuff, which gets us around um, forced socializing, <laughs> right? Maybe forced socializing with family members or something like that. But really, first and foremost, I feel like you're learning how to protect yourself, your energy. And yes, this does feel like you're kind of riding out a storm. Now, last time I pulled a card that had tornado on it, there was actually tornadoes. So sometimes I guess it could be literal. <laughs> but if there's storms in your area, please be mindful. They are intensifying. Take the weather seriously. And we're going to be talking a lot from now on about subtle things that we're trying to overlook that maybe you should be paying attention to. It's not to get you, again, paranoid. It's, that's not the goal. Um, or to get you wasting energy and overthinking things. But just every once in a while awareness. For example, if we're having super intense, crazy weather and someone acts like, oh, what's the big deal? But people actually were unalived and they're acting like it's no big deal. Right? Okay. That's, that's one to, to note. Okay. Uh, think about people using their children or even pets. Oh my goodness, even pets to control people. How? You know, don't touch my dog. This was in Manhattan. Like they had all these show dogs around, especially on the Upper East Side. And like the dog could come up and like, you know, like come up and like try to get pet by you. But like um, the owner would be like, don't touch my dog. That's a show dog. Like, <laughs> okay, well then get your dog on a shorter leash then because she wants to go home with me. She don't like you, okay? <laughs> Or, you know, uh, someone's going to control the situation by, you know, I don't know, bringing their dog along or something, you know, like, like, I don't know. I remember I was at a, a campsite, <laughs> hang on for this story, campsite, no lighting. Someone brought their gigantic black dog. Okay. And there's no lighting out there. Guess how well this went. I almost fell into a campfire. I shouldn't laugh. It was very scary. I almost fell into a campfire because someone brought their black dog and this dog was very loving. Okay. This sweet baby, super sweet baby, but he didn't understand his strength and he saw me, but I couldn't see him. And he came barreling up to me and scared me number one, but I stumbled back and the fire was like right here and it was big. It was a pretty big campfire. And I was a little thrown. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. The owner of the dog had the audacity to be like, watch out for my dog. I know you did not just say that. If it wasn't dark, I would find her, whoever said that. Like, that's not appropriate. Don't tell me to watch out for your dog. You watch out for your dog and, and get your dog away from attacking people in the darkness. Okay? Like, please. But those are just some examples. And they're subtle, right? Like, most people would just laugh that off and go, oh, there's too much going on in the world. We can't be bothered with that. But everything you need to understand that will open up even deeper and deeper, deeper understanding is happening right in front of you. We've just been trained to ignore it. Okay, so as far as protecting treasure and protecting our peace, part of this for some of you today would be going, okay, if, if, if someone, again, like let's say, I got another example. Oh my gosh, this is from Manhattan, coming out of Manhattan. Okay, I was walking down the street. Maybe I've shared this before in a video. And there was this, it looked like a couple and like a grandparent were walking down the sidewalk. And Manhattan kids are brats. Just, just like the movies, 100%. That, that's for real. Uh, this little brat, oh, I shouldn't say that. This kid, this child, precious, beautiful little child, um, was coming. That was genuine. That was a genuine. Oops, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> oh, God, that was a real slip. Oh, we'll leave it in. We'll leave it in. Hey, I'm human. Whatever. This kid's coming down, and he's on a scooter. Now, we were in a part where it was kind of a wide sidewalk, and um, the kids zoom it all around. So I move over to get out of this kid's way. Well, this kid, I think is a precious, beautiful child, um, was coming after me. Like, even though I tried to move out of his way, he would start bringing this scooter at me. And then I kind of <laughs> went over here and he's still coming after me. And then he rammed into me. And I was like, uh are, are you kidding me? And like, I look up at the mom and I'm like, what? And she goes, you saw him there. 
Okay, you see all the nasty? Okay, the nastiness. I, I probably don't need to explain it to this audience. But I only go into the weeds with this because some of us do get told that we're wrong for being upset. We're not allowed to be upset by toxic behavior. There's something wrong with you if you don't want to hang out with toxic people. So we're breaking away from that. Protecting your treasure is saying, hey, I don't care what you think about me. I'm going to protect my peace. All right. If you want a reading with me, times are changing for me. I've got lots of exciting things coming up. It's not that I won't be doing readings. I'll be doing them here and there, but like the wait time might shift. Or if I think I was saying in another video, if I get like a ton of people in, I may shut down the request until I can get caught up. But I will always keep you uh, updated on that on YouTube, on the community tab, where I can just put a post. I don't have to like sit in front of the camera. Community posts and on Facebook usually keep you updated. So if you want to get in and get one of those readings, angelsouls444.com, about one to two days as of the recording of this, if a lot of people get in ahead of you, which happened, what, a week ago, two weeks ago, it just pushed the wait time to like a week or six days or something like that, which usually it's 25 days. It went from 21 days to 25 days. So just, it's good. Okay. Like I'm, I'm on top of things. I'm organized. <laughs> Getting it done. Now, if you want a live reading with me or you want to get a live course with me on how to connect with your angels, working with a certain archangel or learning angel mediumship. Angel mediumship is a different price point from the other ones. Just keep that in mind. Email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com. Whatever reading or course you get, make sure you're taking notes. We're in a time where things, digital things could get wiped. So just bear that in mind. And as we say that, start backing everything up. If you also have a YouTube channel, get a hard drive, back it up, do, do whatever you got to do. And yes, it's still on a hard drive, but maybe when things come back online, you can access it. Okay, so we'll leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.